Cursor is a no-code builder that allows you to enter in a natural language prompt, just like you would on ChatGPT, and then it uses artificial intelligence to build software for you. So if you have no coding experience, if you're not technical at all, you can build software. But it costs $20 a month for their pro version and even $40 a month for their business version. I'm gonna show you how you can get the same output for free. Let's get into it. Alrighty, so step number one, you wanna to come to VS Code, it stands for Visual Studio Code. The link to this will be in the description below. It's part of step one. You wanna come here, you wanna download this. This is a code editor that was developed by Microsoft, right? It's a really reputable and VS Code actually formed the basis of Cursor. So we're literally going and getting the base code editor that Cursor uses for free. So you know, download the Mac OS version or the Mac or the Windows version and install it on your desktop. Easy as that. Okay, so once you've installed VS Code, step number two is you wanna come and open it up on your desktop, just like I've done, and you'll land on this window over here. Next step, let's open this up. And on the tabs on the side here, there's a bunch. There's Explorer, Search, Source Control, Run and Debug, and then we have a final extension here, which is, uh, or final tab here, which is called Extensions. You wanna open that up. And then what you wanna do is you wanna go search for the term Klein, C-L-I-N-E. This is an autonomous coding agent. It's an AI agent that sits within VS Code, right? So we're now taking VS Code, which is our source code editor that Cursor uses. We're now plugging in an AI agent, and then we're going to step three quite shortly. So what you wanna do, click on Klein, you wanna come through, install it. Click the install button, it installs, easy as that and then you'll find it on your tab as the last tab over here, right over there. Perfect, that is step number two. Alrighty, so step number three is we wanna actually plug in some sort of AI, right? Some sort of LLM. In this case, we can use Gemini because the API is free. So we're gonna come through to Gemini. Again, a link to this will be in the description below. Just go check that out, you'll be completely all good to go. Based off of that, what you wanna come through to is the API key section within Google AI Studio which is the Gemini API keys. You wanna go ahead and say, create an API key. You wanna connect it to one of your projects. If you don't have a project, just create one. I've got Gemini API. You're gonna go over there, you're gonna say, create in this existing project, and it will give you your secret key. Now this key here, do not share, like I am sharing it. Do not share it with anyone. I'm gonna copy that, and you wanna come back to VS Code. Back in VS Code, I've already done this, but what you wanna do, is you'll either go to the settings tab or when you set client initially, it will ask you, do you wanna use your own API key? You say yes. And then you will search for the provider, which will be Google Gemini. You can use a bunch of others. So you can go Anthropic, you can go OpenAI, you can go Mistral, any one that you can think of, you can use any LLM. In this case, we're using Gemini because it's free. You're gonna to go to Google Gemini and you're literally gonna go paste the API key in there and click save. Once you've done that, you can just clo uh, close the client extension, open it up nice and big, and this is going to be the, the exact same as interacting with the AI agent components of Cursor. Now you're just doing it in with v within VS Code, and you can go and use AI to build out any piece of software that you can think of just by using natural prompts. So you can put in there, create me a CRM dashboard, or create me whatever you can think of, create Recreate Flappy Bird for me, whatever you can think of, just like you would with Cursor, you can do it, but now you can do it for free. And there we go, in three steps, we've recreated Cursor pretty much, and we're doing it completely for free, so you don't have to go pay the $20 a month. Go try it out, let me know what you think, play around, and if you get stuck, just drop a note in the comments. All the information, all the links will be in the description below, and yeah, I really hope it was beneficial. The one thing I do ask is if it was, please do consider liking and subscribing. It does amazing things for the channel. Also, my waitlist for my private membership community is open at the moment. First come, first serve basis. So be one of the first founding members of that and click the link below. Other than that, I will see you guys on the next video. Cheers.